little YouTube. Well, we're right here. Back on our cage. Trying to get in the uh, last couple of character select screens before we actually finish the beta. Let's see if we can get some, uh, maybe the elf and the furin we need to do, I think. We've done the Nuani, Nuan, and the Harani. So let's have a quick look at the elf. Elves occlude themselves deep in the forest, avoiding other races as much as possible. Though envied for their beauty, their behaviour is considered incomprehensible, hoping for an honourable death. Often deliberately seek out danger, they feel the ultimate honour is vengeance for their past defeats. I think we've seen all these, the buffs is the uh, breathe underwater and the swimming speed. Yep, so let's have a look at appearance. Typical elven look, I think. That's the stereotypical uh, hairstyle thing for the elves. Let's go with that. Put the grey on again. Eyes, uh, they're nearly grey as it is, so we'll go a little bit lighter. There we go. I think I'll just fine. Accept that. So we've done Battle Rage, we've done uh, Occultism. So look at the sorcery, eh? Have a change of name, I think. Since he's an elf, I'll look at silver locks. And create a character. I've switched servers for this as well. had always lived in glory. They had never been defeated. Then, a new day dawned. The Grand Elven King, Aranzeb, led his army into an ill-omened battle. He felt it was the last chance to save the war-ravaged land of Aroria. Aranzeb had known Kyrios, his enemy's leader, for decades. However, any affection between them had long vanished. Hate was the only emotion they shared. Hate as well as hurt. When Kyrios finally slew Aranzeb, a dagger of betrayal pierced every elf's heart. Bards had long sung of the beauty of the elf's forest and the sophistication of its people. But that single defeat changed their fates forever. Their forest raised, their palaces reduced to rubble. The elves became refugees. Cloaking themselves in seclusion, they turned their backs on everything, save their memories. Throughout centuries, elven culture has remained frozen. Resentment and anger are passed down through generations like well-polished stones. All young elves devote themselves to the pursuit of revenge, training only in battle. Would Aranzeb be happy to know his people choose to live like this? To abandon all hope of king or kingdom until Kyrios pays for his transgressions? Such questions are considered deeply treasonous. The elders are now all warriors, studying the art of bloodshed instead of philosophy. Their sole purpose is preparing their people for the coming war. Still, they can only do so much. 
The true future lies in the hands of the young. And secretly, more question the destiny of their race. One youth in particular. He discourages elves from forsaking all other learning. In order to focus only on the past. He knows that at times change comes only through oblivion. But elves have too good a memory. They need to learn that sometimes you must forget in order to live. Well, it seems like the elves have had a rough time of it. They're normally so aloof, aren't they? Just wait for this loading screen to finish as usual. And don't forget to let me know what you think of this uh, this game, Arcage. And if you do like the game, please leave a like and subscribe. Be most helpful. The WASD. Yes, okay. Yeah, uh, WASD. You would know all problem. about that. Flame bolt, rank one. Okay. And it looks like it's a different area. Oh, that's a bit of a surprise. I thought we would start at the same area as the Nui, but obviously not. They have their own stories in their own areas by the look of it. Press F or right. Wish they had some voice acting with it though. This all seems a bit old school. Or lazy. Is, is that the word I'm looking for? It's automatically added to the quest tracker on the right side of your screen. Quests with green markers are for your race. Looks like some kind of a ruined city they were in at the moment. Okay, what have you got for us? with orange or red names. To be most effective in battle, try to vary the skills you use. Your shortcut keys will make it easier to alternate between them. You can attack targets with orange or red. Press Numlock to automatically run forward without hold. That's very strange. Why aren't they lighting up? Ah, there we go. Was, was I too close? Strange, you can't seem to attack those for some reason. Any there we go. object with a blue exclamation mark can be utilized in some way. Simply right click the object or press F. Where are they going? Corpses that sparkle can be looted for items and coins. F picks up all items, while G lets you pick and choose. Hmm. 
Hmm. All right, three, three on those. I don't nuts. Any object with a blue exclamation mark can be utilized in some way. Simply right. Collect tough deer haunch from small deer, okay? Nice effect that fire. Very nice. Definitely need something to push them back or root them though. He's gonna be a caster. Because I don't think he can cast that and move. No he can't. I don't think he would. I mean he could use that and move. area this by the look of it what are the graphic settings on this just curious options let's have a look quality oh we're on very high at the moment so okay very high very high okay Right, okay, that's fair enough. It's all on very high. It, it does look pretty good, I must admit. Travel storm, what's that all about? Is that a speed buff like we found in the other one? Yes, it is. To get from place to place. Ooh, Triant. Earned a skill point. Freezing arrow. Right, we go. Reduces movement speed. That is what we need if we're going to be a caster. You'll find it easier to alternate. Spend skill points to learn new skills. Click the skill icon in the menu bar, or press K to open the skills window. Alright, where are we getting these bird eggs from? Ooh, hello big boy. Deep Thinker Gilead. 52 stars, whatever that means. I take it it means level 50. Hard as hell. <laughs> right, come on. What am I looking for here? Climb a rough bark pine near Beale's camp. Right, okay. Always helps you to read the quest, Nick. You should know that by now. Oh, 
And again we get to climb a tree. Oh, hello. Does that mean you just got what? Oh, damn it. He must have got the egg that was up there. Let's try another one. to the top. Take a meal to memories to sell us down the road. skill points to spend while you're showing me that. to the deep wood now. So oh, here we go again with the uh, help build quest that I think we've done on the other two characters. Yes, here we go. I'll take each one of these. should be inspect somebody's house, should it be? Oh, hello. Take a tour of one of the houses here, there we go. To a model home. Complete. <laughs> what do you need to do next? Collect rock elemental debris. Okay. So we'll hit it with that first freezing arrow and then we should have time to get this off. And again. mean that with the uh, fire spell skills that he, he's going to have to remain stationary which is slightly surprising could uh, circle strafe him with using the uh, the ball well, it seems to defeat the object or when you using like fire elemental skills
teleport to Orcad Brecken still. Alright, another skill here. Never mind. Another question to say, sorry. Debt recovery report to Granish. Oh, an attackable tree, aren't there? I'm not sure that's something that I want to do at this moment. The signpost here that I'm sure will have a quest. Kill tree leaf nymphs. Battle of the Casters. So can you dodge that when they throw? Yes you can. Defeats the object, like I said. Oi. I thought I killed you. Obviously not. Oh, pop. Yes, and attacking me. different. Need one more. Wow, well, I'll take some damage off that. Click the skills icon in the menu bar, or press K to open it. Let's get down here before we look at those skills, eh? Earned a new skill set, open that. Uh, witchcraft, what's witchcraft? Ooh, that's handy. So shall we have witchcraft to go with this? Yes. Calls forth a hand from the ground to hold an enemy, inflicting snare for 12 seconds. Deals 122 magic damage on expiration. Very nice. We'll have some of that. Right, we need to report to Granesh now, which is just down here. I do believe.
Yes, I wish to compete in the field of honor. Okay, do I? I guess I do. Centuries ago, 12 adventurers went on an expedition to find the birthplace of the world. The source of all magic. Unbelievably, they succeeded. When they entered that otherworldly garden, they each received powers beyond imagination. Some were imbued with such strong magic, they were elevated to the position of living gods. Of the two elves in the expedition, one went on to become the celebrated elven king, Aranzeb. He quickly realized that the power the Twelve had unleashed was a blessing as well as a curse. It would destroy their homeland, but the citizens could be saved, given a little more time. Aranzeb helped buy that time by sacrificing his very life. He entered a suicidal battle with his old friend Jean, who had become the god of destruction. When Aranzeb fell, his life force burst forth, washing over the elves whose lives he'd saved. They were imbued with his memories, his feelings, and his hatreds. Okay. Choose a dagger from the daggers on the table. So I have to uh, duel a new knight, okay? And what do you want, An? Store the withered, withered lavender around Sylvan Devi. Looks like a big tree. Yes, it is. Alrighty. So again, pretty basic quest, MMO style. Alright, report back to Ian. Nuffy's cat. Uh, okay. <laughs> right, right, we know what this means, that we've got those. Alright, we get rid of these. Give us XP. Labor points to gather, mine, craft, and perform other vocational activities. Alright, that's all done. Activate quest items by right clicking their icons. Read the book to Nuffy's cat. The monster you're protecting isn't your friend. He's the god of war. 
He's raised countless cities and stolen thousands of lives. Did we not vow? Okay. Don't remember ever doing that in a, a quest before, reading to a cat. Alright, okay. I did knit back onto uh, All Grey on the other server. It was it was playing on my mind that when we were going through the Nuian newbies on there, that other well, people were getting mounts, and I didn't seem to be getting one. So I ran back to the newbies on and did a little bit of harvesting on the uh, on the iron side, iron ore. And I was coming through the town where the the mounts were. There was a quest there that I'd missed. So I did it and ended up getting a horse. So apologies for you missing that, guys and girls. I just thought I'd let you know <laughs> that yes, it was my fault. I did miss it. Right, let's see where we're going now. That's why I was having a look around this town to see if I'd missed anything. to Loz. Loss or loss is it? Elemental Lord to collect Earth Spirits. Alrighty. Let's try this new skill. Uh, big cooldown on that. On the route. Wow. 